I've always been passionate about automobiles and wanted to learn something that will give me an edge over my peers. After doing a lot of research, I came across a few online courses that interested me. But I wasn't sure if an online course was for me. What if it's too difficult? What if I had doubts? What if I lost motivation? But when I checked out Skilling, I realized this is not just another online course. It's a whole new world for learning. I enrolled for their master's program in hybrid electric vehicles at their skill center. These centers are like study centers with state-of-the-art facilities that provide a great blend of computer-based learning and a vibrant classroom experience. All over the world, companies are looking to get into hybrid electric vehicles or electric vehicle manufacturing, but there is no one teaching those skills. It is estimated that this industry alone will create 60,000 engineering jobs world over. We are the only one in India to provide a master's program in hybrid electric vehicle design and analysis. Skilling's courses is not just about teaching cutting edge technologies. It is more than that. It is about teaching students how to solve engineering problems that industry faces on a daily basis. When creating an industry relevant curriculum, it is extremely important to have the right instructor with the right experience. As we engage with the instructor in developing the curriculum, it's important to make sure that the content is transferred to the student in a form that they can understand. Because think about it, industry relevant content is often very complex because of a lot of engineering details that's involved. In order to simplify this process, you have to make sure that you take this entire complex study plan and you convert it into little pieces that the students can understand. It's a phenomenal learning experience and the fact that everything is collaborative makes it all the more amazing. The focus here is on actually learning the concepts instead of finishing the course for the sake of it, which I think is very refreshing. The next important thing that we focus on at Skilllink is building the industry relevance by making sure that students have access to cutting edge tools and software. Most engineering companies out there build products based upon computational tools. Now, as a student, you might not have access to these softwares. Not all of them are open source and some of the softwares are pretty expensive. And this is where our software partners come into play. Skilllink has partnered with a lot of companies to offer cutting edge software tools that students can use. In each module of the whole coursework, you basically work on four projects. In our PGHEV course, which is our postgraduate hybrid electric vehicle course, you will have six modules. So basically you end up working on 24 projects and all these 24 projects are industry relevant. What does this do to the student? The student ends up developing a portfolio of projects that can get him recruited. You have to make sure that you also challenge the students by giving them small projects that they can work on from the start to the end of this course. At Skilllink, while creating courses, we follow a simple process when defining projects. As a student, you will work on a project that an engineer in some automotive or aerospace company is working on. The only difference between you, the student, and that engineer is the scale of the project. You're trying to learn something new and you're challenging yourselves on a daily basis. This means you are going to get stuck a lot. And this is where our technical support engineers are going to be there to help you each and every step. When you're trying to learn an industry relevant technical skill uh, from a subject matter expert and when you're getting all the support and access to good computers and software, an important thing that you need to have is a group of people, a group of like-minded people with whom you can share your learning experience on a day-to-day -day basis. Combining all of that into a single model is the essence of Skill Center. So what the Skill Center does for the students is to support them with possibly everything they need and to remove their distractions and obstacles. And yes, believe me, we have great results already because our first batch of HEV students, they find this atmosphere very addictive. They bounce off their ideas with one another. They are having group discussions. They are getting motivated by each other. And collectively, they are seeing each other grow every day. And that's why our course success is so high that any student 
who finishes our course gets recruited in some of the top industries. The environment is great, the vibe and the energy in this place, great. The people, they actually push you to deliver your best. When you are at a point where you have completed a decent number of projects and you are fairly comfortable with what the course has to offer, our student success team gets in touch with you to discuss the different job opportunities that you can apply for. They work with you to make sure that your resume and your LinkedIn profile is in top shape. Once this is done, they conduct several mock interviews to make sure that you would be comfortable in an actual interview. It doesn't stop there. If a student gets an offer, we sit with them and talk about the next five years of their career and help them understand if this is a good offer or not. There is no magic out here. The students work on the projects, develop portfolios, and those portfolios basically stand out with respect to any other candidate. And that's why the interview success is so high with a skilling student. And that's why industries want to recruit a skilling student. They know that a skill anchor can hit the ground running and deliver value from day one. If you are an engineering student interested in a core engineering job, then definitely check us out. Every time I come here, I lose track of time. Has anyone ever said that about a classroom? I don't think so.